9.17. Shimmy, good call, mate. Probably the wrong call, to be honest with you. Um, I, initially, when I watched it, I thought, okay, red card. Yeah. Then I heard the debate with the TMO, the mitigating circuit sources. He didn't land on his head. He landed on his back. A uh, dangerous play we've seen from the sighting commissioner, I think, saying the right call should have been red. The difference is, I think it's the first 20 seconds of the game. I think a ref sits up and he looks up, says, am I killing this as a contest if I give that straight away? Yeah. Difficult. Initially, when I thought watched it, I yeah. thought he's gone. I thought he's walking here. Yeah. from your commentary. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. No, it was great commentary, by the way. <laughs> but, uh, fantastic commentary. <laughs> you just got it on. <laughs> you just have to listen to me. Yeah. So, 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 Nick, the yeah. laws of the game. Yeah. Do they matter what time? And, no. And it shouldn't? No, absolutely not. It shouldn't matter at all, but... Unfortunately, it does. And the debate that has been had at World Rugby at the Laws Committee is um, should perhaps a red card be given to the player? Uh, because they are, they're, they're, uh, it, was a, it was an act of foul play. It was dangerous. Yeah. It was argu arguable whether he landed on part of his head or his back. Uh, but we can show you the, the, the um, uh, Kwaka Smith one on Havili yeah. in, the, in, in, in the Crusaders game, which, which you will see very similar. So there's a template that the referees have to follow. But if it's in the second half or, le or well into the game, as opposed to the first action of the game, it makes a big difference. So there has been question asked about a red card, perhaps allowing a, a player from the bench to come on maybe 20 minutes after he's been sent off and a yellow card only 10 minutes. So we'll see if we can get the, uh, the clip because we've got the clip together. We've got it, we've got it, Nick, don't worry. So we're gonna roll it just now. Okay, but you see, we've got to carry on talking. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> no, it's... There we go. This so is yesterday. One of the left happened yesterday in Durban. Yeah. Young Detroit. For me, it's the same thing. Okay, here his head doesn't hit the ground, his back hits the ground first. On the right, 27. And on the right, have a look and see if his shoulder and neck doesn't hit the ground before the, 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 his back. So his hand hits the ground first, he braces. And then, I think it's, you know, that is, that it is debatable. Listen, they're both exceptionally dangerous. One, Kwaka Smith, was the final of a super rugby game. Yeah. And Yaka Paper had the courage to say, that's a red card, I'm very sorry, those are the laws. And probably, AJ Jacobs should have done the same thing, probably. Um, uh, there was concussion, there was, he didn't pass his HI yeah. uh, test. So uh, clearly, Schroeder was, uh, was injured. And uh, that shouldn't come into it. It is just a template of, of whether he landed on his head or not. But he certainly had whiplash that uh, caused the back of his head to hit the ground. Yeah, it's, it's, I, I think time is relevant. Uh, Nick, uh, for me, you, you look at that, you know, for a ref, you, you watch it and, the, the, you know, we never used to see a lot of red cards. Now the cases of red cards have gone up. Yeah. Which means it's more pressure, which, which means you can get a ref in the beginning, a, a red card in the beginning of every game. I agree mm. with changing that law. It's yeah. red for the player. You can replace yeah. it maybe after 20 minutes. Yeah. Then it's easier for, um, was it AJ, to, to yeah. say, listen, make a decision, yeah. Yeah. this and that. I, it's going through his mind. I, you watch five minutes of a lot of games and it's yeah. a penalty yeah. to maybe um, swing the, the result. Yeah. Yeah. Some refs say, I'm staying out of this. Yeah, exactly. I don't want to make a decision. Exactly. And that's because of the pressure that's put on. So you have to look at it. I sometimes like the way rugby league's doing, where yeah. they might say, you've had three yellow cards, you on watch or whatever. Yeah. One more, you get an automatic two-game suspension. Mm. Then it's clear yeah. as daylight. So yeah. you say, listen, TJ Pernari, you got a yellow card. You got cited a week ago. There, yeah. There's three offenses. One more. Behave whether we like it or not, whether you're part of citing or not, it's an, an automatic three game suspension. It's done and dusted. So, at least pre game, yeah. you know which players on hold. Uh, just two seconds. Yeah. Uh, I just want to confirm what the law says. I mean, at yeah. the moment, yeah. you know, we, yeah. we're giving an opinion, and it's what uh, the law gentleman here in the studio. Nick, there it is, okay. 9.7. A Dave, player. Uh, player must not tackle, charge, pull, push, or grasp an opponent whose feet are off the ground. Clearly, that's exactly what Jan Detoy did. Under review of the match footage, the siding commissioner, this is what happened, deemed that, in his opinion, the incident had met the red card threshold of foul play. So it is going to go to a, uh, a siding commissioner, and I wouldn't be surprised if there is a red card now post-game given to Jan Detoy. Um, just on this one point of, of my, my view of a game, to take the pressure away from the referee to say, I don't want to spoil this game by giving yeah. a red card. If he knew that a player could come on 20 minutes afterwards, not 10, a yellow card, 10, so it's a, an appreciable uh, period that the team struggles without uh, at f having to play 14 men. But what it does is it stops the game being spoiled as a spectacle for the yeah. spectators and the viewers because you knew when Kwaka was sent off in the game against the Lions, 15 against 14, the Crusaders were yeah. going to win the game. 
where you knew when Bismarck Duplessis was sent off for his tackle against Dan Carter, where he was sent off for another yellow card, it wasn't high and it wasn't, um, and he did use his arm, and it spoiled the contest. So we don't want to spoil the contest, but we want to punish the individual, and we don't want to punish the team too badly. A 20 minute for a red card, I think, without the player being allowed to come back on, that player who caused the offence, he's off definitively and should get banned for whatever afterwards, but a player on the bench can come on and replace, replace. So he's, he's still got a All right, so that was yesterday in Cape Town, where a yellow card was given, and I think we all know the sighting has happened. I think a red should have been the call, and the Chiomo decision, AJ Jacobs turned that one down.